Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today is going to be a video about the Origins Clear Improvement Active Charcoal Mask. I'm hearing a bunch of really great things about this online, that's why I purchased it. Um, and I'm just going to test it out today for you guys so you can see if there's any noticeable changes in my skin after I've used it. I'm just going to take and pull back my hair really quick. And I'm going to apply this mask with my Real Techniques. I guess this is a foundation brush, um, but this is what I normally use for masks and, and stuff like that. once a week or as often as needed. Um, open pores with warm, with a warm moist towel, a layer on, allow to dry, and then rinse well. It doesn't say how long um, to wait before rinsing it off, um, but I'm just going to wait until I notice that it's dry and I will be right back. Okay, so the mask has been on for about 15 to 20 minutes. It'll probably dry a little quicker if you um, apply it in a thinner layer, but I like to like really pack it on um, to get the best results possible. I know it's probably um, to some people it might be wasting product, but that's just how I like to do it. I'm going to zoom you in so you can see. There is a lot of cracking along the bottom here, and it's really getting to the point where it's irritating my skin. It dries to a really matte finish, and it's one of those tight masks where you can't really move your face. Um, if you have sensitive skin, I wouldn't recommend this for you because I have sensitive skin and the parts where it's cracking is like itching really, really bad. Um, so I'm going to actually, this isn't even completely dry. Um, and I'm just going to wash this off my face because it's really, really itching me. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. And as you can see, it has left my face really, really red. Um, and this mask is, um, supposed to be really good for clearing pores and I guess clearing up acne, um, but I couldn't imagine somebody that actually has acne and because I feel like if you have acne, you have really sensitive skin. I couldn't picture somebody using this because this really irritated my skin and I don't even have acne that bad. I mean, I have like breakouts, tiny breakouts, but nothing major. Um, and for the price that you pay for this, I just don't, I wouldn't recommend it. I've been using it now for a couple months, um, and I haven't really seen any noticeable change in my skin. Um, so for the price that you pay for this, I just wouldn't recommend it. Um, there's probably better ones out there, and this one's so talked about that I just wanted to make a review on it, um, just to let everybody know my opinion on it. I want to know what your favorite masks are and which ones really, really work. Um, feel free to comment down below and let me know some brands of masks, or your favorite mask, um, so I can pick them up and try them out. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video. I will see you later and have a great day.